Welcome back guys to another video. So why I live a boring life? So not to brag guys, but I lived a very interesting life. Um, and when I say interesting, a lot of it was fun and it was also character building in terms of experimenting and self-developing. Um, so when I say a boring life, I don't necessarily mean that you're just partying the whole time, what they call YOLO life, right? Um, I don't think you should do that. I mean, obviously there's periods in your life where, well, not periods in your life, but maybe like a few days or like a weekend, depending on the occasion. Yeah, just have fun for sure. But that shouldn't be like a routine thing because it can be self-destructing. You're not building any good habits. Um, but what I mean by why live a boring life, meaning that why live the average, the normal life and doing what society tells you to do. And I'm not saying that's necessarily wrong, but it's kind of funny because if you ask the average person, uh, what do you like to do? I mean, do you like your job or do you like the current situation in your life? And they always give like a big sigh or like a big grump and you always hear them complaining, not all, but I mean, a good majority of the people that you would probably ask. And then you wonder why they're not willing to change or why they chose that path. And there's a number of different situations, right? Um, but it's probably a combination of they didn't know any better. They were told that they had to do that. They're a little bit lazy or they're afraid of change. So it's a combination of those factors. But then you kind of ask yourself, if you're in that situation, if you're watching this video and how I was years ago, I'm like, okay, well, why not change? Like, why live a boring life? You know, the odds of being a human is one in 400 trillion. Um, life's a beautiful thing the world's a beautiful place i know there's a lot of bad going on but what i mean by a beautiful place i mean that there's a lot of amazing places to go and see in the world and there's a lot of amazing cultures there's a lot of great cities and countries and locations um why not go and see it or why do the average thing maybe if you have a, a little bit more of that entrepreneurial spirit why not do it i'm not saying you have to quit your job but i'm saying that in your free time like what are you doing in your free time and if it's stuff that's not really adding value to your life, then why don't you do a little, you know, some normal, some abnormal stuff. And then who knows, it might take off. And then you don't need to work that job that you hate or that you wake up going to every day, dealing with people that you don't want to deal with. Um, so it's a thing that's not going to happen overnight, but it's a reality check. And I think most people, consciously, they're aware of maybe they're not living the type of life that they like but they don't know where to start or they don't know how to change it or they're a little bit lazy or they're a little bit afraid, which is fine. It's, I mean, I want to say don't be lazy, but it's normal to feel and think that, but instead of just making it like a temporary thought and then going back to living your normal, boring life, why not start to take action? So have a think about that. Um, if you have any questions and if it's something that you like to discuss further, in detail first link in description book a call with me and we can talk about your current situation in your life and I can maybe throw in bits of advice uh, recommended because you know everyone's situation can be a little bit different right so if you like to discuss those details with me just again book a call and we can talk about it and this is something that I go heavily into detail in my course so with that guys thanks for watching the video please like and subscribe and once again, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.